All right, we're going to go ahead and take a look at how to add fractions using the number line. I'm going to share my screen. So what we have here is 2 and 3 fourths plus 1 and 2 fourths. And we're going to look at two different ways to use the number line to do this. The first one, we're going to take the larger mixed number, 2 and 3 fourths. It always makes more sense to start with the largest mixed number. And we're going to find that on the number line. 1, 2, and then 3 fourths more. 1 fourth, 2 fourths, 3 fourths. So right here is 2 and 3 fourths. Now we need to add 1 and 2 fourths more. I'm going to go ahead and add one more hole to bring it from 2 to 3 and 3 fourths right here. Now I still have 2 fourths more to add. So let's count forward. 1 fourth, 2 fourths. So that brings us to four and one fourth, or four and a quarter. So two and three fourths plus one and two fourths is four and one fourth. Another way you can do it is when you look at the mixed numbers, you look at the whole first. So I'm gonna take a look at the two and two and three fourths right here, because that one is the larger number. Let's see. So I can find two easily on the number line right over here, and then I'm going to add the 1 to the 2, so plus 1, which is going to bring me 2 plus 1 is 3, up to the 3. Now we still have the 3 fourths and the 2 fourths left. So 3 plus 3 fourths one-fourth, two-fourth, three-fourth, brings us to three and three-fourths, but we still have to add the two-fourths. We did not add that in yet. So let's bring the two-fourths down. Plus two-fourths, so from where we left off, one-fourth, two-fourth, which brings us to four and one-fourth, or four and a quarter which is the same as the answer when we added two and three fourths plus one and two fourths using the number line above it. Just a different way to get the same answer. You can use the method that makes most sense and is easiest for you.